Hey, hello, and welcome to Backpack Battle, the demo, which everyone has been playing a lot of. And, you know, I've seen a bit of action played, so, you know, it's, um... Why have we only got a mushroom? <laughs> I thought we started with a dagger as well. Um, buy items from shop and dragging them into your inventory. You know, I've seen a little bit, and maybe I understood, misunderstood, because I could have sworn she started with a dagger. So... You know, it's like Hearthstone, but it's an auto battle. Also, we've got a extra thing on a backpack to begin with. I didn't... Did I just buy that? I don't think I did. I'm already confused. Maybe it's just because it's the first ever game and people don't normally do these things. So there's, you know, it's like Hearthstone, right? So that goes with that. We need a weapon to begin with. The stone can upgrade that. So rather than having a lot of minions, you just have a few items. And um, sure, give me a bag of stones. Does that affect anything? It only affects things above it? Okay, whatever. It's not really necessarily even buffing anything. That doesn't buff anything at all. So let's just go with that. We keep our money and give them a big whop from me. And then you watch the opponent, who is also a real person. All items will activate automatically, unless this is a um, bot to begin with for the first ever one, and it has crashed. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen that happen. It is a demo. Um, maybe we get to continue that run. Don't ask me why it's opening in window mode. It should be in full screen mode. Um, right, so let's continue the game and let's start the battle. Wait, 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 wait. Oh no, we had money. Um, <laughs> okay. I've never seen people play with the chibi mode. Chibi mode doesn't mean sexy thing normally, but I guess in this instance it is. Okay, well, they've got literally no thing. They've just got money and <laughs> banana and a thing. So it's lucky. Well, we lost our first round. <laughs> I had no clue because it didn't show me and I thought we were just going to be going straight into the first round again. Okay, there's a Goobert. Goobert can do fun things. We can upgrade our sword with these two things. So let's do that. Um, I don't know if I lost all of the 12 monies. Um, you will gain round leftover gold transfers to the next round. Okay. So, you know, I've spent whatever money we had left over. You can also re-roll the shop and things. Um, gain one sweat if you have at least 10. I guess that's energy. Gain one luck instead. Mana. Okay, so it's mana. Food triggers 10% faster. I mean, the mushroom is maybe not necessarily doing anything with Goobert at the moment. Goobert can activate things all around him. Or he activates when things activate around him. So you need to <laughs> work on positioning Goobert, right? So that triggers with that. Do I want to trigger with that? Right, so if I mess about with the stuff, right, that's going to go there. That will go there. Right, so he activates now with two things, but then I need to put that there, and then this still doesn't trigger with anything, so let's just shove it under Goobert. He's at least triggering a bit more often. I'm just going to keep the four gold, and we'll go in. We won one! I'm very surprised that we won. You know, we got very lucky because it didn't actually work with the thing, but yeah. Also, he doesn't keep me fine. Uh, you know, Kiwi doesn't mean dress in a sexy way, <laughs> as far as I'm aware. A double kill kid, we got him double killed. Okay, so, yeah, pull that down to re-roll a thing, but I don't want to. Um, you can lock items from combining by right-clicking them in your inventory. Okay, that's interesting. So you can stop things combining. The... Steel Goobert. Okay, so Goobert is going to absorb the sword if I don't do anything about it. <laughs> Which means we need a weapon. Right, I'm going to keep him there. He's still going to become Steel Goobert, even though it says Poison Goobert. Um, none of these items are that great, so I guess it's trying to encourage me to actually do that right. That's on sale. And that's the weapon, right? So I'm going to do that, and then we're going to shove that in. 
And you know what? <laughs> okay, well that's going to activate Goobirds a bit more. We have six gold left. Um, affected slots become, when the effect is applied, gain damage. I mean, I can make the weapons gain a bit more damage, but again, the sword is already gaining more damage. Okay, that's giving that more damage until Goobert gets affected. We're going to have a bit of a stamina problem, which is an issue. Increases the rarity of the shops. Oh, I've seen cards do a lot of stuff. So let's do that. Um, I'm going to hold on to my two coins and we will go into battle and see what we can do. So yeah, things evolve. He's trying to get a steel sword as well. But, you know, we've got a steel Gubert, which um, I'm sure that'll do some things. Okay, so he heals us for 11 when our things activate five times. We are using a bit extra stamina because we had the... Um, Thing, but Goobert is about to change, so he's not going to heal us anymore. Okay. He, he is not... Wait, can he become Stoner Goobert as well or something? Like, <laughs> he was supposed to make Steel Goobert then. White size three dragons. On reveal, gain 12 for each cards before inflict three things. Well, I mean, we don't necessarily have that, so... But cards are good, right? So I'm going to do that so that we actually get Steel Goobers. Because <laughs> I thought we were getting Steel Goobers. In fact, I'm going to put that right there. And then, you know, we play our White Eyes, Blue Dragon. Because, you know, Yu-Gi-Oh decks. I uh, don't know if that's any good. Um, health drops below 70%, we gain luck. We don't really have much backpack room. Okay, so two backpack... Backpack slots and the items within them trigger faster, which is actually pretty good. Right, but we're going <laughs> to have to mess about. Okay, now this probably is stupid because it's using up more stamina, but I feel like that's not the worst thing to do. In fact, banana. And we're going to put the banana so that we get stamina. And then the banana is also... Okay, so heal and regenerate one stamina. And then we're going to shove that there. So that might help with our stamina problems. Maybe. <laughs> and it also buffs that. So, you know, that's also going to be helpful. The food all buffs each other. This guy's a banana man. Just full of bananas. Uh, but we are debuffing him with stuff that I don't know what we're debuffing him with. You know, I haven't really paid that close attention to what we're doing. It just looks good stuff. And we're going to win easily by the looks of it. Because he is dead. <laughs> okay, so that's four wins under our belts. And then the Ace of Spades. Okay, so now we've got Steel Gubert. Um On reveal, your next hit is critical if the number of cards before it is odd. Okay, so does the... I don't think that counts as a card before it, does it? Right, what does Steel Goobert do now? Um, five activations, the weapons gain plus two damage and gain 16 armor. Okay, so that's going to gain plus two damage when things activate. We're going to buy the cards and... So it needs to be there for it to even activate. So we need to move that up there. Okay, I mean, for the moment, that can sit like that. And that's fine. Right, so that's going to activate. That's going to activate. Right, so Goobert has less things to activate on now, though, which is a problem. There's an extra Goobert. I need more backpack space, unless I take that out. Okay. <laughs> now, that doesn't help us that much, but that's in multiple things now. That gets the extra buff of damage. This then activates, and then this activates. Nah. 
That's not helpful. Right, that can go there. That can go there. This doesn't help that much. We're just going to need to re-roll and hope for more backpack space. We got more backpack space. Okay, perfect. So I just rearranged all of that for nothing. <laughs> okay, so the Ace of Spades. Why are you messing up? Like that. Then that there. Then that there. Then banana back there. And then that there. Okay, so he's getting activated. Um, inflicts one something. Decreased accuracy by 5% per stack. I mean, it's on sale for one. We can always sell it back for one. So, you know, I'll take an extra bit of sand to throw in their face. Why not? <laughs> They've also got some sand to throw in our face. And a uh, lump of coal on the end of their swords, because why not? Uh, I think we're still winning, Victoria XD. We are still winning this. They've got a lot of stones and things, but we're actually doing okay at our first ever backpack battle. Okay. Now they didn't choose to go TB. Now there's this, which is a um a choice of things to do. Right. So triggers extra attack, inflict two random debuffs. And 1% accuracy and minus 1% crit chance for debuff on your opponents. Um, items trigger 100% faster in fatigue. Okay, so if it ever goes to fatigue, everything triggers twice as fast. And every three seconds inflicts fatigue damage. Uh, weapons steal 20% life. Your healing is amplified by 25%. Your attacks steal life. Poison steals life. Okay, poison deals one damage per stack. Okay, so if we get poison or we get fatigue. I'm going to take the fatigue. Okay. <laughs> There's no way of making this reflect both, but I feel like that's going to be good for us. Um, I mean, the dagger should be good because it doesn't use any stamina. On reveal, gain 12 block for each card before it and flick three colds. Tempting, but I think we need backpack space more than anything right now. Okay, and we got backpack space. And then just uh, whatever can go there. Um, right, so. Goobird is going to buff that, so that's good. Can only be thrown once per battle. <laughs> I mean, it's a one cost thing. Although, if I sell the sand, you get the Wide Eyes Blue Dragon. And I think that that's probably smarter. Okay, that'll do. Stamina usage is now low because. For some reason, we gained extra stamina. <laughs> I don't question it. We okay. We've got um, spikes and things, so we've got a lot of good stuff. We are dying though. So you know, vampirism might have been a good idea for us, but we're not doing the worst. In fact, fatigue. That's what we're waiting for. Once we get to the fatigue time, they die, <laughs> and that's what I was counting on. Okay. Um. Start of battle, gain two vampirism. Okay, that might be pretty good for us. Hungry blades. Okay, start of battle, gain vampirism. On hit, convert one heart into vampirism. Maximum damage increased by one per vampirism. What does this do for us? Um, gain plus two damage if they miss. Um, we gain mana and inflict uh, blindness. Honestly, right, that's 1.5 stamina use. That's one stamina cost. Honestly, I'm getting rid of the broom. We're taking this, Hungry Blade, and we're taking this, which works with the dagger, and we're going to have a bloody dagger. Okay, I think that's looking good for us. 
Okay, and then they've got ordinary version of the skin. What is their backpack right now? <laughs> it's a lot of stuff, but I don't think it's really going for a common cause, is it? Okay, we win. Like, we're already ahead of them, and, you know, they've got the same fatigue builds, but we just win, so... Easy victory is easy. We didn't get to see the one loss that we had. I, I think it just lost because the game closed. It wasn't that we lost. It was just, you know, it chose to say you lost because you didn't get to see it. Right? <laughs> okay, so that's going to keep us alive now. We've got two vampiric blades. We've got a stamina bag right here. Now, how do I... Okay, so I can move the bag side to side like that if you want. Um... We may want to. <laughs> okay. Affected slot star. Okay. Um, heal one per vampiric item. Okay. So... That's going to go there. That's going to go there because they then both still get buffed by Goobus. And then they get the effect of that. Now, this is unfortunately not going to be necessarily in there unless I find a way of messing about with our backpack. Or I just get lucky and get a backpack. Or we get a hollow fire lizard. Um, deal 10 damage for each card before. Okay, I mean, I'm buying all the cards. I'm sure I can figure out a way to get this. Right, this counts as a weapon, right? So we're going to shove that there, right? No, it doesn't count as a weapon. Okay. Do I want that one buffed or that one buffed? I think the dagger should be the buffed one. Right, so if I go there, there, there... And I don't click in. It looks like things were working. Um... <sighs> There's got to be a better way. There's got to be a better way. <laughs> there has to be a better way of sorting this. I'll start there. Right, Ace of Spades. Right, we don't want to start with the Ace of Spades, do we? If the number of cards for it is odd, right? So we want the, um... That. God damn it. <laughs> we're just going to shove them all in here for now, and we're going to figure out a clean way of getting this done. Right, so... If I go there... And then we're going to go Ace of Spades. And then we're going to go you. Then Charizard. Then that. <laughs> now it doesn't let me put my banana in there. But. Okay, does this ever buff with anything? What is this even meant to buff with? It's not ideal, but it gets the banana in there. Really, I need that by the banana, which means I then want to swap these around. But then... <laughs> okay, it's fine. So, sacrifice for the greater good of Goobert. We're going to go with that. <laughs> it's a mess, but it, it, it's my mess. Okay, they've got a big old empty backpack. They've got poison, they're a vampire, so they're going to be sucking our blood. They've got defences and spikes. But we're fatigue, so I don't think Guzin's going to win. We are a fatigue monster, and they are going to lose. Okay, yeah, easy fatigue battle is easy. <laughs> okay, 
I think we're doing pretty good. Uh, man orb. Right. We're lacking backpack space. So we're going to go with that. And then we're going to put that there. Okay. So we could make a mana blade if I had the money. And I might just do that. You know, just because it's extra attacks and then like why not okay we're gonna go in with that all right now we've got goober activating properly okay they're also fatigued and they've got a um scythe which is probably a lot more scary than our stuff but we suck blood with some of our weapons as well we've got a lot of buffs and they've got one some mana <laughs> i think we win this I, I think we still win this okay easy who needs defences when you just win? <laughs> oh no, we have literally just started off on the um, most basic. Because we are, you know, <laughs> unranked. And uh, may have a little experience just from watching a couple of streams. I haven't seen that many. So, you know, I've got some knowledge. Okay. Um... We really don't have room for more of the um, things, so I'm just going to re-roll. Okay. Backpack space is good. Stamina. Like, we're kind of okay on stamina. Items inside trigger faster. Like, that is good. Oh, also, Darkest Lotus. Generates three mana. For every mana, remove a random buff from your opponent instead. Tempting. Tempting. I kind of want it all. You know, items trigger faster. Okay, so. Items triggering faster. Like, this sword will now stab faster, which means we kill them faster. So that's pretty good. Like, extra space is good. We're not using stamina a lot at all. How much does that sell for if I did buy it? It doesn't tell us. That's unfortunate, because I like, you know, if it sells for two, it might be worth buying, but I'm just gonna go in. <laughs> We're just gonna go with it and see what happens. Okay, so Tigre has potions and thorns and gems for days. But it looks like we're probably going to kill them. They're a vampiress, but they're not sucking our blood that much. And we're a fatigo, and they are going to get the fatigue pretty soon. Stronger than us, whilst we keep hitting them. So whilst it was sort of tied, like we're a fatigue monster, so the longer it goes on, the better for us. And, you know, why wouldn't you go to survive around? We gained one heart back, which we lost, and... Now we go infinite. Okay, so there's an extra dagger. Spectral dagger. Right, so. <laughs> I need the dagger to be able to activate. In fact, that's going to sit right there. That solves that. That gets the dagger in for Goobert to effect. And... Why not take another day? <laughs> um, gain mana. It's not that good. Black Lotus. Okay, so we need to then figure out a way to get <laughs> the Black Lotus involved. Which is not so easy. <laughs> I don't want any of those. Okay, backpack space. Backpack space lets us get things involved. To a degree. <laughs> Perhaps. Okay, so we got the Black Lotus involved. That is 
only going to make Gubert Shigger once, though, which is unfortunate. Um, okay, we hit that on two things, which is good. And then that's all of our money. <laughs> we made it work. The Black Lotus is going to remove some buffs off of them. So, you know, we're going to have plenty of mana by then, surely. So I think that's good enough. And, <laughs> you know, the Overrun might be a lot more powerful people. This guy has some fancy pans and the whole bunch of vegetables. He's the Sir Fry Walk Hero. But he's still losing. Jansus, the fruit and veg walkman. Can't handle what we've got cooking, unfortunately for him. And that's fatigue. <laughs> and that's fatigue. And a whole we've got a lot of stuff, to be fair. You know, we've got a lot of stuff going on. Okay, they had no chance. There's a protective purse, which gives us one extra slot, which might be useful. Um, there's a lightsaber. Which gives us regeneration. But you know, our empiric blade is pretty good. Okay, so I can't move my backpack anymore just because of the way that I've got it set up. Gain four armor, like... Yeah, there's things that I can do. Yeah, so you can see by the way that I've got it set up that it's not really going to work out, but... Okay. More backpack space. Right, that's just one coin. You'd be stupid not to take it, right? Backpack space, right. That lets us maybe sort out a card problem. Um, stamina is kind of okay, but... That does poison. Legendary melee, but we don't really have room for it, right? Is there anything that I can really get for this? Right, let's take a banana. We're not really running out of stamina, but sure, let's do it. Okay, we'll figure things out. <laughs> this is getting a little bit messy. Okay, you've got a lot of potions. It's a potion seller. You've got some sort of emanating cap. You are also a fatigo. Ah, fatigo with a lot of potions to try and keep yourself alive. But you don't realise that I'm sucking your blood, so you're just feeding me with those potions. <laughs> So, okay, we're losing. We're suddenly losing. Oh, that was kind of close. If you hadn't have had 80 health potions there, we had that. <laughs> um, that gives us luck and things. That's um, a dragon, but it's a bit late for that. Cleanse and heal. Becoming vulnerable for two seconds once. Okay. Spikes, blocks, lux, mana, give a weapon extra damage. I mean, it's on sale cheap. I'm going to give that some extra damage and then we will figure it out from there. The Ace of Spades, next hit is critical. Um, Gain one spike. It's not great, is it? When you have at least 20, consume and convert 15 health to 30 block. Is that... I mean, we've got a blood potion. Next, it is critical. This is yellow. I'm going to take the potion. There's nothing really good for two, so we're just going to go with it. Because we can always blood suck them again, so I think that that wouldn't die pretty quickly here. But yeah, converting 15 health to a block and then just, you know, sucking his blood back. Yeah, it works. Easy. <laughs> I think that's the only reason we lost a lot of health is because we drank that potion and then we lost the health. Do -do. Um, trigger faster, remove luck from your opponents. Hmm. Is that <laughs> really that good? I don't know. Right, we got 17 coins. We've got to survive four more rounds. It's trying to give us stuff. Okay. 
Um, that combines with that, which is interesting. Um, opponents can reach debuff on your opponents and deal 0.3 damage. So we can do a lot of damage to them, especially as we do do a lot of debuffs to them. Um, we could gain more vampirism. I can make another vampiric blaze quite easily. Quite easily. Stones will be thrown repeatedly. Stones marked with that become... Oh, so we are supposed to buff stones. Well, it's not really doing anything for us, is it? <laughs> Let's face it. It's not doing anything for us. Six. I mean, how many slots are you? You are four slots. What are you buffing with? The Okay, so we can make it a manor or a vampiric. I kind of just want to get another vampiric blade. Why not? Let's just do that. <laughs> that feels like I could get it in there somewhere, but we need to then figure it out. I'm going to just buy it. You know, why reserve it when we can just shove it in there? It gives us the shop space back. It's, you only reserve it if you can't afford it. Okay, you've got a lot of armor and you remove spikes. Okay. And you've got an interesting, different looking character. Um, you've got an entire backpack and it's already full of shit. But, you know, we're hanging in there. Honestly, you've got a health potion though. Um, you've got some sort of piercing arrow. Oh no, we're dying. But we are fatigued. We might catch up. We probably are catching up. What is your speciality? You're dead. <laughs> I couldn't tell what their speciality was. The speciality was dying. That's what it was. Okay, so we got to survive three more rounds and we have four hearts. So basically, we already win. A fancy fencing rapier. Okay. Well, that's something new. <laughs> that's, um, I've never ever seen that. It's godly. On hit, use three luck to gain two damage. <sighs> Do we want that? <laughs> I don't know if we even want that, to be honest. Like, it looks fancy and all. I could heal. Right, we've got a lot of potions now. And now we've got a potion belt to put them in. Okay, perfect. Right, so. Now we just need to figure out how to put these potions together so that they mix okay <laughs> so that's going to mix with that and that's going to mix with that i don't know if that's necessarily good for us but it's what we're doing and then i'm just going to move that there just for convenience <laughs> it's what we've done is there a better way of arranging this backpack there probably is right Okay, so that's future-proofing so that we can put a card there. There's got to be a smarter way of doing this, right? If I move that. Okay, I think there's some sort of slight problem with the um, positioning of things. You know, it's like the mouse looks like it's over a, a position, but it's not quite... That's it. <laughs> okay, the banana's a bit more effective there. They're making a poison blade. In fact, they've got a lot of poison blades that they're trying to make. We drink our potions and they become other things. And, you know, because that was combined with the health potion. I think it actually means that we don't lose any health at all. And then this monkey just dead. <laughs> and that's 14 wins. All we need to do is survive two more rounds. Which is easy. Cleanse the blindness every 8 seconds, and then use 10 stamina to become invulnerable once. I need it. <laughs> uh, well, lovers! Regeneration heals for a bit every few seconds, I mean. Right.
Okay, we can fit this in. And then that go there. Right. <laughs> now, how did I just mess up my entire backpack in one go, do you think? Right, that we rotate like that. That we rotate like that. And that buffs both of those. Okay, and then I'm sure <laughs> things will work itself out. Okay, well, that combines with the health potion, but it's not going there. <laughs> There's no chance that we're going to move that around to rearrange that. I mean, if I had the um, one extra slot, but I just can't be bothered. Items trigger 20% faster. You know what? That does not use stamina so why not and then let's throw a stone at someone's face and the stone works with the potion i mean stone oh it needs two whatever in that instance uh heals one stack every two seconds that triggers a lot so why not i mean just show it there why why not <laughs> We're not min-maxing too much, but, you know, we're going to win easily. Oh, but unless... What the heck is this? Gemstone-filled inventory and legendary sword falcon blaze and a lot of fruit and veg. Hey, he's still dying. <laughs> this guy's still going down pretty easily. He didn't buy smartly in the Black Friday sales, did he? 15 wins. Okay, all we need to do is win... Well, all we need to do is survive one more round. We've already won, let's face it. But what do we want to do? I could buy a yellow potion for no reason. <laughs> I could buy an extra dagger that I could maybe figure out. I can fit that in, actually. Sure. <laughs> Get stabbed by an extra dagger. What are you trying to combine with? Some, oh, the thing at the shop, right. <laughs> Could make it. It's not gonna make anything. We don't have the space or time to make anything. That can go like that. And then, why not? It's cheap. <laughs> and then, we don't really have room for anything else, honestly. We could buy an extra. Well, we can maybe pointlessly. Get an extra backpack slot. <laughs> There's nothing that we can fit into it. Uh, the lovers. Could spend years trying to figure out how to fit the lovers card in. Will not. <laughs> out of gold, right. Well, for friendship and money. Let's do this. Easy wins, right. Dark Styler. Lots of defense. Fatigue build. What the hell are these? Strong stone potions. Okay. They are literally just stones. Is it going to help you, though? Like, you're not actually hitting me. I am running out of stamina, but fatigue sets in. We are fatigue builds. You are also. Okay, you are getting some back, but we have blood steel. We could still win this. He said too soon. <laughs> okay, 15 wins. I'll take it. We still won. 95% <laughs> accuracy. Well, that's the only uh, item that's shown us. 68. Easy win. Uh, the full version will have more characters and more items. Okay. We're not going to Steam. We're keeping playing. Well, that was our first ever one and we won. I could have sworn that you were meant to have... Is it because we're Chibi that we don't have a dagger to start with? We just start with a mushroom. Seems a little ridiculous. Okay, well, a sword. That's on sale and it gives us money. So I'm just going to take it. <laughs> and, you know, we've got a bit of an extra backpack slot. Let's... Four, five, six. I can afford that. Right, let's take that and the broom. And the broom combines with the frying pan? <laughs> okay, let's combine the frying pan and broom. Okay, we're probably using too much stamina because I bought two weapons in the end. <laughs> this guy's got a sword. Well, actually, we're just going to smack him down because, like, you know, he might have a banana and some extra stamina, but... 
Two weapons, kill someone with one. <laughs> so, easy victory. Okay, so... Frying pan... Makes a shovel! And then I could get a banana for some extra stamina. Which I should do because we're using so much <laughs> stamina usage. Very high. A lump of coal. I had to suck it onto weapons. I mean, suck it to them. We're probably going to lose this one to build this shovel, but let's do it. <laughs> Again, has no weapons. It's an interesting tactic, for, sh for sure. Like, they're surviving, but their plan is to out-eat us in the fatigue, and it's not going to work. <laughs> so somehow, despite our lack of stamina and three weapons, we still won. Okay, if you use up two stamina, you can attack. Yeah, I got that. Okay, um... This has a chance to dig up an item, and it now uses less stamina, and now we've built some things. Okay, so you can see that there's a lot of different things that we can build, like the stronger potions, different weapons. There's a variety of different daggers, there's some sort of things, there's a Charizard. Keep backpack spaces! Good. <laughs> Um, I'm not going to buy any more weapons. Gain two regeneration? Sure. Give me a bit of regen. Okay. Items trigger faster. I'll take it. And we'll put... That like that. Okay. The banana's only buffing that. That's only buffing that. That's fine. That wants to... Combine with the potion, okay, but we need multiple of those, I imagine. Um, I mean, let's take it. <laughs> oh no, no, only needs one. Just to make the upgrade, you know, just to unlock the recipes, why not? This guy is lucky with one frying pan, but he's not going to be lucky for long. I think he is literally going to die here. So, we're getting some pretty easy wins, right? <laughs> okay, there he goes. Easy. I know that we're at the bottom rank, but... Jesus. <laughs> you know? Um, applies the effect on the potion without consuming it. After being consumed, also applies the effect on the potion without consuming it. Okay, so I guess we need another potion to... To apply the effect onto the other potion. Um, give it! Yeah. Right. <laughs> we need to figure out a way to make Gubert activate. Right, so that can go there. That's fine. Yeah, that's, that'll, that'll do. Right, so he only activates on the weapons at the moment, but that's fine. Um, can only throw him by once per battle. Mushy. Right, so let's take that. That buffs all the other things in some way. I have not paid attention to the fact that we have stuff in our inventory. I've been wasting things. Okay, so we dug up another garlic. Interesting. <laughs> Well, in that case, I mean, we can sell that back. I bought the garlic because I was like, we have room for garlic. Let's just use it. Didn't realise, <laughs> didn't pay attention to the fact that we were digging up items and they went in our inventory. Okay, so Benjamin Kzubak is getting smacked. Okay, that was a long battle. So it's a good job I sped that up so far. Okay, and then we've dug up a stone. So we've got two stones. Do the stones combine with anything? They don't. What we need is backpack space. And that's just four additional slots, but this one gains uh, maximum stamina. And then we put it on Gubert's side so that Gubert gets activated more. Okay, so he's only going to activate once off of that. 
Lump of coal. I need literally on sale for one, so I'm going to take it. Do, 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 do. We could probably combine that with something. Cheap gloves are cheap gloves. <laughs> okay. Um, there's got to be a better way of arranging this backpack, right? Stone. Banana. Now let's me get that out. It gets rid of our potion, which is unfortunate. I mean, the shop giving us one extra money is okay, but I think we can go around without it. You know, we don't need to get all the money. And we're digging up items now. Okay, this guy has a sword and a pan. Mr. Lonely, but I still think we beat him. Okay, he has got some regeneration. Which we haven't. <laughs> Could have sworn I had a regeneration thing. Oh no, we're actually suffering with stamina usage. Fatigue. That's a problem. Why am I suffering with stamina? <laughs> okay, so that's something we're going to have to address. Backpack flops trigger faster. Oh, it's because I combined it with the potion. Um, deals one stack of poison. Consume this meal for 12 and cleanse poison. Okay. Um, that gains regeneration when we heal, but we only gain the regeneration when we're lower than 50% health. Um, has 25% chance to inflict on activating storage coffin. Okay. Do all things in the coffin activate poison? Okay, I didn't realise that. So, if you have things in the coffin, they can activate poison. There's a chance to, at least. These damage taken by 25% chance of 5%. Could be good, but we... Well, we do have space. Let's reduce our damage taken. You won't find a cap of resilience keeper anywhere. Well, it was on sale, wasn't it? <laughs> okay, backpack space. Perfect. And then that kind of pays for itself because we've now got that in there. The Hungry Blade was pretty good, though. The Hungry Blade was pretty good. They combine. Well, <laughs> in that instance, I think we take that and we combine them, just because they make a thing. We'll see. Has a shovel and a broom. I think that might be pretty stamina heavy there. I think that's an interesting choice. I haven't got any actual daggers. I should change to daggers, not swords. Right, so we're both suffering with fatigue because we have no stamina. <laughs> But I think I'm still beating Bussy, especially as we had a potion. So, yeah, we won because of the potion, mostly. It was close. But the Hexblade is... Triggers extra attack on stun. Inflicts two rounds of lethal. It's half price, so why wouldn't you? Okay, well. <laughs> One blindness, dig up a random item. I need the coal off of that. <laughs> now, we might be in a little trouble for a round or two because of this. <laughs> but, okay. We've got 80 million stones. What I need is backpack space. Backpack space. Okay, right. So you can have all of these. 
How much does that sell for? For one? Well, we've got a few too many garlics. Oh, that the cards were good. The cards were good. And the thing is like yum 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 yum. Do, 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 do. Our stamina usage is high right now. Okay, that buffs that. I mean, I should put the lumps of coal on these. In fact, I'm going to put the lump of coal on that. <sighs> it's a shame I don't have a way of making that work better. Because Goobird's just not getting the activations and I don't have things that I can do. I mean, I maybe do. If I move that there, I can put both of these here, but then the banana isn't being used unless I move things again. Right, so that goes there. That goes there. Right, banana bird. Okay, Goobert's getting fully activated. We've got the banana. I mean, Goobert doesn't get activated 10% faster. Like, I need that to affect that. <laughs> if I put that there, though, that activates 10% faster. It is probably going to use more stamina, though. But it'll do. <laughs> right, we might lose this round, but let's go for it. No, we, we're going to win this. I don't know what the heck is going on with his backpack, but it doesn't look good for him. <laughs> a lot of empty space. A lot of future planning. Didn't consider his impending doom. Okay, so now we've got this, which um, converts regeneration into vampirism and spikes and deals one damage per... Spike, okay, and vampirism. Not bad. It's vampiric. We're not vampiric, though. Okay, that triggers that. We're going to take extra space. <laughs> Can get a second Goobert. I mean, I? Wow. <laughs> How much? One second? 1.5? 1.5? We need better stamina usage, honestly. We need better things. <laughs> I mean, we're doing good. I'm going to buy an extra bit of space. Okay, so. Four. Fancy fencing rapier uses luck. That um, destroys armor and costs one stamina. Lee, we get rid of this and we buy a cheap dragon egg. Okay, that needs to go into that. Okay, this has two slots, so we could put some extra sauce in that. But this will do for now. Okay, so they're also trying to make the same sword that we've got. They've got armor and then they've got some claws of attack and they're a vampire. So they are, of course, going for a vampire blade. I think we lose this one because they are much better suited to the build with the vampirism. Although, okay, we're not fatigue damage anymore. Oh, that was close. It was close. Considering they had vampire speciality. Um, opponent below 30% deals 50% more damage. It's on sale and it goes in a weapon. Items trigger 10% faster. Gotta take it, right? We might want to focus on trying to make a special Goobert. Item activates, gain some mana. Okay, weapons, gain plus one damage. We probably should have got the sword and kept the sword so that we could have made the steel goober. That would have been smart. <laughs> Bit late now. Okay, extra stamina and extra space is okay. Weapons, gain plus one damage. I mean, I'm going to do it. 
How many slots? That only goes for like one slot, right? Okay, that's fine. I just need more daggers. We're not getting any daggers. <laughs> not necessarily happy with this run, but we're still doing okay. Okay, we're reflecting damage? Okay, I'll take it. They've got a lot of health. They've got lots of weapons. The claws of attack are actually pretty good. They don't use a lot of stamina. I might consider trying to make that. Okay, so what, we need spikes to put in our gloves? I might be able to do that. <laughs> okay, that's keep. Um, that cooks a weapon. But then we need to figure out how to fit it in to cook a weapon. <laughs> Give the weapon plus 27 damage. Okay. I can do it. Okay, so that's now cooked. Yeah, I think that'll do. Okay, now we've got a little pet dragon. Which we might need to figure out how to evolve into a full-on Charizard. Okay, they have lots of vampire items and they are vampire classed. So, Leia Machina. I don't know, we're kind of doing okay against them considering they're all vampire classed up and everything. We're actually kicking their ass. You know, my stamina I have not addressed. <laughs> Even though we've got literally one weapon that uses stamina. We've done nothing about that. Um, okay, so we could gain luck and things, right? You don't combine with anything. Health drops below 70 gain luck and... One in power weapon damage is increased by one per stack. We're kind of going hard on weapon power, so I'm gonna take that. <laughs> Extra health potion wouldn't be the worst. But, you know, that prevents that happening. Okay. Consume this and deal damage to your opponent. I'm going to reserve the potion. We're going to start, you know, maybe going into some potions and things. <laughs> Should have maybe got the stamina potion. Okay, they've got a stack to heck swords. The, the vampire blades. Alucard, the vampire himself. And they are making a strong health potion. But I think we're still winning somehow. They've actually got a dagger. They've got things. Okay, we're going to go survival because why wouldn't you? Okay, so we're going to... Combine both of those. Okay, and then we can put the mushroom with these. In fact, I should put it between both of them. Because that's smart. Okay, if I can find one more mushroom, we can actually make mushroom goober. So I should have been focusing on things like that and thinking about things like that. But we didn't. Because <laughs> we might have had more opportunity to do that than anything else. Mm. I mean, backpack space is always handy. 35% chance to block damage. We gotta survive seven rounds with five lives. I'm gonna take it. I'm not that happy about it, but you know, whatever. We've been getting extra money from the piggy bank, but we're still never got rid of it. Potion seller with a million potions. Okay, so this could be interesting. They've got a panda pan, a pandemonium. They're getting cooked. We're dying though, but there's still a chance that we're dead. <laughs> 
<laughs> we're dead. Okay, they just had too many potions and too many good things. They knew what they were doing. Extra piggy bank. I don't know, it seems a little late for piggy banks, doesn't it? <laughs> it's two pounds. It'll pay for itself in a round and then we'll sell it back at some point. Um... When you have at least 20, consume this and convert health. I mean, do we want to do that? Stam dagger. Dagger is now extra attack. So, you know, that's, we've been waiting forever for that. If I buy this. I should sell this shovel as well <laughs> at some point. How much do you sell for two and four? <laughs> okay, let's just mix a million potions together and it'll do some stuff. <laughs> What's the worst that could happen? Capitalism! Okay, you've got interesting stuff going on. We have all the potions of all the varieties all mixing into each other. We've got a lot of swords and things. Well, you've got a lot of swords. We've got a goober that heals us with dying. No. You've got vampirism for everything. <laughs> fatigue. We're not a fatigue monster. Nope, we're getting it back up. Oh my god, what happened there? Fatigue healed us. <laughs> we get stronger with fatigue? Okay. So we can make bloody gloves, we can make a bloody dagger, we can make a blood goobert. I mean... Vampiric gloves! Sounds good to me. So let's do that, it's something! <laughs> uh, weapons gain plus one damage, we never really finished with that, did we? Um, extra infantry space is always good, and it is extra stamina. Let's take it. And then survive five more rounds with four hearts. We're just going to go in and keep the three coins for another day. I realised that we could have maybe made a special goober with the thing, but Delavia! Okay, you're getting debuffed and you're getting buffed with vampirism. You are actually not vampire class. You are the same as me and you're dead because <laughs> you're not as good as me. Okay. 12 wins. Okay. Um, heals one per stack when hitting a melee weapon up to 100% damage. Okay. So that's going to be causing extra... In fact, I should be smart and put that there. Because that's going to buff both of those now. Okay, and then we're going to heal damage from those. Regeneration poison. Uh, opponent regenerates health. Consume this and inflict three poison and one to yourself. Do we have things that... Cleanse poison. <laughs> Part of me is like, hmm, what if I combined that with a health potion and made a super weird poisony potion? What if we combine... Can you combine two of those? I've never seen anyone do it, but I do wonder. Like, can you make a super dragon? Not the thing inside of it. Right, so if I put that there, or there, there. Okay, so that still combines with that. And then if I buy that, that does combine that. We could make a poison dagger. Could. Okay, so that's a poison red potion. Okay, so now we've got a weird synergy with all of that. I like it. <laughs> hmm. Okay, an extra shield slot. Cleanse a blindness and become invulnerable for two seconds. I mean, we've got one stone. We haven't got two stones. 
I really need another mushroom to make a poison juba, don't I? No chance of fitting that in anywhere. <laughs> Let's face it. Um, add one slot and gain a little inventory. Nah. I mean, that's cooking that, which is unfortunate, because, like, you know, if I had room to mess with things, that would be pretty fantastic, right? I mean, we've got a space to shove a thing. I might as well do it. I don't know if we've got anything remotely mana, but... <laughs> sure, whatever. Spectral dagger, it makes a dagger as well, so let's just do it. <laughs> Basula Iron Face. He has Iron Face. This face is getting destroyed. Okay, we've got so many buffs that it's ridiculous. <laughs> but he is hanging in there and doing some damage to us. He had a million potions, but these potions did not do enough. Okay, we've still got our stamina potion with some steel skin. In fact, you know, that's actually interesting because we were suffering with... um. Stamina fatigue at one point, and now kind of going away. Um, every five seconds, randomly gain that or stamina, and triggers ten percent faster with each item. I just don't think we've got the space to figure out how to fit that in, really, have we? Although I could get rid of the piggy banks, which are giving us some money. We need to survive three more rounds. Temptation is just to buy another piggy bank. <laughs> okay, um, health below 70%, gain luck and eight once. I mean, they weapon damage is increased per stack. It'll trigger twice with two pairs of boots, right? It's not just you, you know, are screwed. That should make sense, right? That's on sale. So I'll take that. <laughs> now figuring out how to fit it in on the other hand is another problem for another day, I guess. Can I get the customer loyalty cards? I can. Increase the rarity of one shop. Sure, let's do that. Okay, it only took one thing anyway. So that was me thinking it was taking up two slots for some reason. <laughs> We're probably going to sell a lot of that next time. Gimli, the Son of Glow, is steel goobert and a lot of armor and removes spikes and things. So, it might screw us a bit. You're also a fatigue monster, so we're going to die once the fatigue comes. Unless it somehow heals us again. Because, you know, I don't know what that was. It was probably just our potions. Okay, we're not necessarily using all our potions, but 13 wins is still pretty good. Survive two rounds with three lives. Oh, that can also be combined with the blades. Do something. <laughs> um, I mean, this just gives us <laughs> space. <laughs> Don't ask me what I'm doing. We've already won. The high stamina, we're just making a goober do something else for reasons to evolve it. Wow, a million pieces of armor is certainly an interesting choice. They have a lot of armor. They are still dying! <laughs> okay, but somehow this armor is not... And they're a fatigue monster though, so they're going to own us in the fatigue, unfortunately. Yeah, so once the fatigue started, we got in trouble. Although, no, we're in trouble. We're almost, we almost bought that back, despite them being a fatigue monster. That stupid, stupid thing. I... 
you know, if there's something that Goober combines with and is already fully, it shouldn't be blocked by the poison mushroom, in my opinion. That shouldn't stop Goobert from doing his thing. I think that's a good combination of how we've got that all set up, to be honest. That works with that, and then what else does it work with? Goobert. <laughs> of course, Goobert. Um, Reroll. Right, extra one of these. Whetstone, weapons gain plus one damage. Right, let's put that there. Like, that is something that I've been screwing up, I think. Right, so that... Also, the stamina usage high screwed me, didn't it? And the, the whole point was it was meant to go away this turn, but... I messed it up. <laughs> okay, that... There's no point in buying that because that's going straight into Goobie. Although it apparently also goes on to choosing things. So let's do that. And then sure, the coal also goes on to things. So let's do that. I'm just going to buy it because it's two coins and you know, it's a little extra infantry. Right, so we've got to survive one more round. So this is going to combine with Goobert for probably no reason. <laughs> And you've got a million spiky things. So, Gladiator, this will be an interesting one. Mistakes were certainly made for certain. We're actually doing okay, considering you're a big old spiky boy. I'm surprised. <laughs> and we won with two lives left. It didn't combine with Gubert, and we're all the way up to silver now. Straight up to silver. It's a shame we can't like grab these things. Although, that's <laughs> sort of glitching into it. And so, like put them in a backpack. Ah, I can rearrange that. <laughs> you know, just be like, have a sneaky extra thing that you catch out of the air and put into it. Okay. Um, well, first things first, we need a weapon. That's on sale, so I'm going to take it. <laughs> um, gain regeneration? Sure, why not? And then... Okay, I can blind them. Chance to deal plus one damage. Sure, give me a little extra damage. Okay, let's go in! And maybe that one extra damage will work. They've got a frying pan and two stones. And we have a thing. That smacks them with a broom. And the broom beats the frying pan. Probably because of the one extra damage. <laughs> okay. And then that combines with the broom. To make a shovel. And then we... Basically, are throwing away an entire round, so everything else really doesn't matter, right? <laughs> like, we acknowledge that we are just losing here. Generates a low quality gemstone. Don't care about the gemstone, really. Um, potion. Yeah, it does building for the future, although I can put that there now. That doesn't do anything better with that. Okay, so yeah, that's uh, about the best that we're going to do. So what if I do that? <laughs> yeah, that'll do with losing this round because of the high stamina usage. But we're building a shovel, which we're going to sell later because it's not that good. But, you know, it's something for now. Okay, they've got a broom and a sword. And they're going to win. Because they're not using so much stamina as us. If they don't win... <laughs> Good, they won. That would have been embarrassing. They also had bananas and things to keep up their strength. So, you know, they were doing very, very good. Um, let's take that for some extra money.
I mean, banana is maybe essential, and I don't want pocket lint, which is going to go in, but extra space is kind of a consideration. Okay, so they're making a stronger sword, but they might lose this one because we're smacking them with a shovel. Kendra Kendrick. I don't know what the heck that's meant to say. <laughs> And they've got a loyalty card, so they're building for the future. But the future smacks them in the face. <laughs> Pardon me. Extra piggy bank. You need space. Okay, um, regen. We'll take the regen. It might keep us alive long enough to be able to do something. We just need better stuff in the shop. You're a spiky boy with a shovel and a sword. I think you're using too much stamina. You've got a banana for extra stamina. That is something. Uber Shung. But I think you're actually losing this, even though you're a spiky boy. No, it's close. I think they actually bought it back in the end. <laughs> we were ahead of them from... Oh, they had a potion. Yeah, it's the potion that saved your life. Do it. Hey, Goobert. It's a combining with that. I was like, why is it combining with the pig? It isn't. It's combining with the potion. Okay, also, I'm not paying attention to all this shit that we're getting in the biggie stuff again. Because I never pay attention to that. I am so good at life. Okay. Um, chance to deal one damage. Right, let's get rid of the frying pan. I'm not going to be using that. So, let's do that. Goobert! Wants to be Mushroom Goober really, really badly, doesn't he? Okay, let's make a strong health potion just because we can, and then let's go in. He really, really wants to be Mushroom Goober. What is your backpack? You got one sword, a million spaces, a banana, and basically nothing. How do you ever expect to win this, Lock Phoenix? How do you ever expect to win this battle? Like, yeah, it's a strong sword and you're buffing it, but Jesus Christ. You know, I've got the space as well, but I've got stuff that actually wins. <laughs> you were impressive out there. No, my opponent was just that bad. Um, That uses three stamina, but it stuns the opponent, but I don't think we want it. <laughs> um, That triggers things 10% faster. So let's put that in there. Okay. Right. First things first, we need to make sure that Goobert is actually getting triggers. Because he's not getting triggers. Um, in which case that goes straight the way back there, not the coal. <laughs> that goes there. Right, can we put coal on things? Well, let's just shove coal in our inventory for now. Even though I'm probably literally going to take stuff back out. Um, you know what? And then shove that straight into it. Sure, why not? He really wants to be Poison Goobert. So I'm going to say you can be Poison Goobert. And then, you know, we got the regeneration potential. Thank you for the follow, Video Lucas. Hello, hello. How are you? How's your day going? Yeah, I think we'll go with Poison Goober and see how that does. <laughs> and the power of capitalism. They're making a banana potion. And they're also blowing things with their trumpets. Um, crit chance on their things, they're making a lucky thing there, but Fogatino is going to die to fatigue more than anything. <laughs> so I think they just lose pretty easily. Okay, that's four.
Okay, now what are we doing here? We're doing poison, deals one poison damage per stack every two seconds. Um, that's vampirism. That's just making things trigger two random debuffs on here. That was kind of good. But the fatigue's on sale. <laughs> How can you say no to something that's half price? It's Black Friday after all. Um, sure, give me the deck of cards and we'll be a card kingdom player. I think the shovel's had its day. I think we now go for the hungry blade. <laughs> you know, the shovel has had its day. Right, you need to reconsider all of your entire backpack. How am I going to do this? <laughs> also, that thing can then come off onto that. What does that even do? Um, the ruby... What do you do? Lifesteal 10% of the damage. Yes. Okay. It steals life. Perfect. That's already lifesteal. We should have gone with lifesteal build, perhaps. I know I can fit that in there somehow. I know I can. No, stay in the boots. Move the boots. There you go. Right, so that lets us do that. Then regeneration. It's about the best that we're going to do for now. Maybe we get... An extra space, okay, right, get rid of that, give me more space. And then I can shove <laughs> everything else in there. For the moment. Um does that go in anything? No. Okay, perfect. Do, 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 do. What does TWSS mean? <laughs> I have no idea what you are saying. Um that we're gonna reserve because it combines with that. Oh, that's what she said, of course, of course. <laughs> oh, they're also making the vampiric blades and they've got a spiky build, unfortunately. I don't know if we're going to beat this one. Balfool! They've got a lot of interesting stuff and we have a poison goobet. <laughs> There's a chance! Actually, we're fatigue monster. No, they lose. <laughs> yeah, we just win by fatigue. Very easily. Okay, but... We're gonna have to sacrifice a round or two, perhaps. Um, that's cheap, so I'm gonna take that. Right, that also lets us... Right, half of this shit's coming out of the backpack now. <laughs> Just while we figure things out. Okay, so is there a way that I can make this work? Right. Everything comes out of the backpack until I figure out what the heck I'm doing. Okay. At the very least, that's going to combine. I mean, <laughs> it's not the best way of doing it, but it gets the potion done. Actually, I need Goobert to trigger, so... You know, the banana's also going to go back in. There's got to be a better way <laughs> of arranging this. Hmm. Right, that's going to have to stay like that for now. I think we're basically sacrificing this round. Oh, there's not space there, of course. Yeah, this is just a sacrificial round just to get the thing done. <laughs> I guess. Um, right, two coins. Do I want the sand? No. Do I want the extra goobert? Potentially. <laughs> like, we're not going to have that. It wouldn't hurt to have... Yeah. I'm going to buy goobert. He's just going to sit in our inventory for now. But let's do it. <laughs> Maybe we get a super goobert. Okay, they're also fatigue, and they're possibly also going to struggle for stamina. 
Why are they doing this? <laughs> like, you know, I'm making a thing. I don't know why they've overstammered it themselves. They're not getting any benefit out of it. So they just made a stupid mistake. <laughs> I'm at least solving that on the next rounds. So now my stamina problem is gone. Theirs, however, is going to stay forever. Um, stupid. Right, so now that we've solved that problem, <laughs> everything comes out again. Right, so that maybe goes up there. Whilst I try and figure out our backpack situation. Right, that's going to go there. Right, potions. I mean, for the moment, they can just sit like that. I don't want Goobert to just trigger once. I know he's trying to make Omni Uber Goobert, but <laughs> we're not necessarily doing that, right? Oh, money can go there, right? You are going to sit there even though that's inefficient. We're not getting any coins. What is this? Hmm. This really isn't going that well, this run. <laughs> this really isn't going as ideal. I have money. I'll take it. It's not ideal. I mean, I'll take it. Facts. If I put that rabbit there. We can make potions that combine and do things. Okay. Yeah. Convert 15 health to that. Right, I'm going to swap those around because I think that's the better way of doing that. Goobert's not getting activated enough. It's not ideal. So I need to put things in to activate Goobert. The Ace of Spades! Your next hit is critical. Sure. But then... <laughs> then we have the problem. No, that sort of is fine. Okay, one. This will do. I don't know if we're going to win this round, though. <laughs> I don't know. Mm. He's got a strong stamina potion. But he's planning on using a lot of stamina. He doesn't necessarily seem to be doing a lot with that arrow. And he has one shovel. We should win this. With fatigue. Easy. Oh, he's got a frying pan as well, but just seemingly wasn't being used. <laughs> okay. Uh, the lovers. If the number of cards for is equal, gain two regen. Okay. Yes. Right. So. Suddenly, things are coming together. We've got a banana and a thing in there that we're just not using. Right, so banana. Should absolutely always have the banana out. That's what she said. Um... <laughs> right, and then... None of these are really that good. Extra space, right, things trigger 10% faster. And then, again, not... Ideal, because he's only getting, like, one activation off of that. This... this <laughs> it'll come together eventually. Mana, random buff from your opponent instead. I mean, I'll reserve it. Right, that'll do for now. It's all going to come together eventually. <laughs> okay, they've got a lot of armor and they've got one weapon and a vampire thing. I don't know if they're going to win this. They look like they're ahead, just because we've got a lot of poison. But maybe we bring it back with the fatigue. OK, so we've got potions and stuff that we're not using ourselves yet. And then they're dead. So, you know, it looked a little scary to begin with, but we managed to bring it back. OK, dagger is always good. And then I'll take the... Thing. And then the Ace of Spades also 
gives us critical hits if we've got less things behind, right? So that. <laughs> okay, Ace of Spades exits critical if the number of cards before it is odds. Well, these are in the wrong places to begin with because there are no cards before it. So that should be thirds. That should be seconds. For each card before... I mean... I'm just going to shove it there just because it doesn't matter that much. If the number of cards before it is odds. I mean, I could put both of those in a row, but... Meh. <laughs> okay, and then... Honestly, I'm going to sell one of the piggy banks to get a card, even though we don't have space for these things. <laughs> I can make space. Right, so... See, I want it to trigger off the weapon, which is a little unfortunate. The most Papega backpack in the world. Trying to figure out how to make it work. I can do this. Right, that still lets Gubert do that. He says. <laughs> Whatever. I'm just putting that there just so that I can get that out there and then do a little extra damage. It's, it's still arranged really stupidly. <laughs> This is still such a goddamn awful backpack, but it's working! Okay, they've got good stuff. There's... We shouldn't win this, but we're going to. <laughs> we shouldn't be winning this! How the heck are we winning this? Didn't even use our potions. Okay. That I will take. That lets us get another card out there and then we shove the dragon. Why did we win that? <laughs> okay, things trigger 10% faster. Hmm. I can make that. These work so much better as well. Okay, if I put that in two, does that trigger 20%? It does. It does. <laughs> I need to rearrange this so much better, but we're not! <laughs> Somehow I'm still refusing to rearrange this, even though I absolutely certainly should. It just getting rearranged. Okay, that's going to go in there just because we got the money for it. In fact, no, oh, too late. I was going to put the money back in because we had the space for it. Okay. Poison Dagger, Poison Goo Birds, Bloodsucker Fatigue, and Spikes. We shouldn't win this. And yet! <laughs> and yet, we do. How on earth is my stupidly, poorly rearranged backpack winning this? How? Artifact Stone Cold? Okay, I've never seen that before. Unique. I mean, I have to take it. It's unique and it's on sale. How on earth am I winning this? <laughs> um, could get a poison potion. And mix it with some of our other potions. That wouldn't be terrible. But. Okay. Backpack space. Essential. Ace of spades. Right, so. If the number of cards for it is odds. One, two, three, four. Okay, there you go. Another Ace of Spades? I don't think we need that many Aces of Spades. Weapon hits inflict one frost. Okay, that's going to be hitting a fair bit because it's triggering 20% faster. 
I'm just gonna go in. We gotta survive six rounds! Yeah, they've got a lot of stone potions. They've got a dark saber. Okay. But that's all you got, really. Not a lot. You know, a lot of blockage. But it's not keeping you alive, is it? <laughs> And we win again, somehow. I mean, this one, it was more understandable, you know. They focused a lot on block, they didn't have a lot of good stuff. We did. White Eyes Blue Dragon. I mean, it's on sale cheap. You can't say no to it. <laughs> I need backpack space, though. Backpack space, perfect. Right, that can go there. I need a, just a little bit more backpack space. <laughs> just a little bit more. Hey. Right, so rearrange everything. If I put that over there. Okay, if I put that there, I can make that still trigger that. That didn't help with the situation, unfortunately, but it lets us trigger the other Goobert quicker. If I put that there for now, and I move that, right. I'm sure that helps in some way. <laughs> right, so that can go like that. Now, if I had better backpack management... I can't quite fit it in. <laughs> Theoretically, there's some way I can fit that in. That's just a mana orb. Don't want it. Okay. Potion belt. Which means now we need to completely <laughs> decimate this entire system. Whilst I figure things out. Right, that can sit there for now, right? Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Okay, so two potion belts together. And then that goes into that. And then... There it is. Let's <laughs> just say, we've got a fourth potion here somewhere. Um, stamina belts. Right, again, need to decimate the system temporarily. Because that can fit there, and that can fit there. Okay. Lovers. I need Ace of Spades there. I need you there. Okay, we fit the extra card in for the moment. In fact, if I put all these down, I, <laughs> I could future proof. We're not going to, it seems. Too much effort to try and future-proof. Okay, right. So then we bring this all back in to sort this out. That solves that problem. We've still got three coins to sort. And I could maybe get another Lover's card. <laughs> okay, I mean... That can go there and trigger on both of those. That does cause a problem with that. Okay, so it's like, if I go around the sides, like, there's stuff that I can do. Yeah, 
there's stuff that I can do to make this work. Right, okay, you go all the way down there, lovers. Okay, that gives us a little extra space. So lovers, if the number of cards for is even one, two, three, four, five. Like you need to go there. <laughs> okay. Perfect. Now I could consider thinking that. Just to, you know, mix things up a bit. Okay, that'll do. <laughs> we spent far too long on that. That'll do. Uh Nat at the Coco. Gains a lot of puff buffs. Uh, what the heck is that? You have a skull in it? <laughs> a skull in your frying pan? Okay, you are also fatigued, but I think you might die here. You also have all the cards in the world, and they did not help you. <laughs> Our card deck was better, so the little bit of time that I spent was definitely worth it, right? <laughs> Um, next hit is critical. You know, all that time that I wasted trying to figure things out. It it wasn't a waste. Things were useful. Right, just to future proof, I'm gonna put that like that. <sighs> you don't have room for the cards. Okay, um I'm gonna take that. I'm gonna take an extra dagger. Daggers are always good. You know, they're free extra attacks, so let's do it. Um, the Ace of Spades, an extra shield space, or I can get a thing that makes mana. Do I want to mana attack, or do I want to just regen? Is that not the thing for the potion? <laughs> or do I need two? Is it two for the strong health potion? No? I wonder why that's not triggering. Whatever. <laughs> not gonna waste forever trying to figure that out. That'll do. Okay, so we can still make that work, and also... Maybe. <laughs> maybe. Is that worth it? I'm sure there's a way that I can figure out how to get that to work. Right, so that one would need to go like that, and then that one would need to go like that. You yeah, know, it could work. <laughs> there's there's gotta be a way to make that work, right? Too much effort. <laughs> Too much effort. I'll just leave it at that for now. There's There's a way. There's a way. <laughs> it's just not worth it's just not worth the 10 minutes it would take to figure it out. <laughs> okay, you dug the easy. They're making a poison blade, but they're already dead. Like, I don't think we even need to bother watching this. They're... Lasted a while, but they're dead. It was actually a lot closer than I thought. But they did lose. <laughs> um... Hmm. Okay, extra bag of stamina. I mean, we need the space, right? Let's get this out of here. Okay. That goes like that. That goes like that. That goes there. <laughs> Here's where it becomes an entire mess of cards running around the outsides. So that one needs 
even no odds number of cards so one two three that's fine we haven't messed that up didn't i have an extra card somewhere <laughs> i messed it up okay right so that's fine um you can only throw him once per battle I mean, the weapon hitting, getting the freezes is better than the once per battle, but that does prevent Dubit triggering. But that's not that good. Mm, whatever. <laughs> it is what it is. Um, what are you trying to combine with? The health potion. Oh, because that is already a strong health potion. That's why it couldn't combine. Because I am being Papega. Extra cards. <laughs> we've just got to survive three rounds and we've got four lives left anyway. We already win. It's not worth too much of the um, nonsense. <laughs> Is that worth it? It might be worth buying that. That's on sale for three. But then I need to figure everything out again, right? <laughs> okay, so that's going to go like that. Ideally, I should keep that in there because, you know, trigger 20% faster is actually really, really good. And then I'll put that in the top corner there. Ten percent faster. You'll have to deal with it. <laughs> I wonder if that'll make a difference. I wonder if I've screwed myself with that. Because that might have been what was keeping us winning, but whatever. We're still won. <laughs> we are still won, even if we now have messed it up. One poison dagger. You've got a lot of cards and a lot of mushrooms and onions and all sorts of nonsense and some spikes and some birds i don't know how you win this and a little bit of invulnerability and you're a fatigue but so am i so oh you have got a hidden dagger but yeah you don't win <laughs> there was very i don't have room this is for one coin so you know easy purchase is easy in fact, I should put that over here. That goes like that, and then we put the poison beneath it, and then, you know, that works. But what do we even want anymore? <laughs> um, the Ace of Spades. Ah, there's no room for anything. I mean, a cheap book is a cheap book. So let's just take it. <laughs> and we just continue our win streak. And you've got a lot of armor and hardly any weapons. So you're trying to fatigue, but you're going to lose. Unless. Okay, no. Okay. You had so much armor that you actually did manage to pull through that. Because nothing was hurting them. That was actually interesting. Um, we just don't... Is there anything I ever actually need or want at this point? Another potion? We have like three spots that we can do. A Charizard! Deal 10 damage for each card before and gain... Well, I'm going to replace that with a Charizard. And I'm going to put that on something. On the other dagger. You know, it showed me there are some things that we could want. Yeah. <laughs> that, that'll do. Survive one round, we're gonna win it. Easy, you know. And you've got two Goobits, a big giant sword. You've got 
a lot of swords. It's a Twitch streamer! Hello, hello. You're about to be maybe defeated. You've got a fatigue build and a lot of blood sucking. Actually, they might win. <laughs> they've got a dragon, they've got all sorts. It's close! I think we still win this though. Luckily, we still won it. Okay, 15 wins. Easy, easy, easy. He's another Twitch streamer. At their own game on the first ever time that we've played it. <laughs> Undefeatable, you might say. Okay, so that means I'm gonna lose my next round, obviously. <laughs> After saying that, we have to lose. Okay, let's take that just because it's there. There's a easy one thing. Uh banana is pretty convenient, and then I should put that with the banana. And why not? It's on sale. <laughs> yeah, that'll do. Let's just go in with that. For friendship and money. And he is already making a shovel. And he's not making a lucky thing. And he's going to beat us with this, perhaps? Nope. He got close. But no cigar. One broom beats a broom and a shovel. Who would have guessed? Because we had the extra damage. Give me money. Money me. Give me now. Do, do that. Banana and then that. And then. <laughs> There's gotta be the way. There is a way. Okay, perfect. There we go. So we can Tetris it in. Easy. Right. Friendship and money. You are making a lucky thing and you've got a spear. But I think we were this. Again. Perhaps. <laughs> Even though you got a shield that is blocking some damage. Yeah, no, we win that one. Okay. If I get another whetstone, I can upgrade with swords. But. Okay. Frying pan to dig up things is probably. There we go, which means we lose a round or two. <laughs> we sacrifice, right, that's going to go there so that I can maybe get some triggers on some other things. We sacrifice at least a round to make a shovel, even though I end up selling the shovel. Dagger? I mean, we get the garlic quite a bit. I want the dagger. <laughs> okay, that lets us keep attacking whilst we're out of stamina. And then we're going to do it like that so that they both get buffed. And a chance. It's not a very good chance. I could have totally put those spikes back on as well. Okay, you've only got one shovel. But we lose. <laughs> By one shovel, I mean one broom. Because one broom beats a broom trying to make a shovel. Okay, the mushroom is cheap. We can make mushroom goobert. Or, if I didn't buy that, <laughs> I could have bought the ripsaw blades. But we didn't. Okay, let's make our uh, things trigger faster. Let's do that and then let's put the card deck on because cards are good. <laughs> okay, that was it. Right, let's go. Spiky boy with too many swords, honestly. He's got a dagger and two swords, but he's actually hurting us and he's actually got stamina to save it up. Okay, no, it's probably the spikes that are, we're injuring ourselves, let's face it. Wow. I told you we would do for a loss. <laughs> After I cursed it, I was like, well, now we'd lose it, don't we? Again, am I going for that? Do I want to make the swords? Ace of spades. Keep back back space. Okay, we dug up a loyalty card. 
Is it just one plot? It is. Okay, let's make the claws of attack. Sure, why not? And, um... Sure, we'll reserve a goober. Okay, let's go in. It's never over till it's over. We're using hardly any stamina now. He's got two things. He's making a lucky piggy bank. I don't know what the lucky piggy bank does. <laughs> let's face it. Uh, three wins. Okay, that gives us another dagger. Do you like my daggers? That's a lump of coal. Attacks even faster. I mean... Poison Goobert is Poison Goobert. <laughs> so... There's got to be a way. Okay. Let's get our other dagger out. We're doing a little less damage, we've got less stamina, but with low stamina usage. Poison Goobert gives us space back, and I think that's good for me. Okay, bananas with two regular swords. I think we win this. Yeah, easy. Okay. Stabby gloves is stabby. What does stabby gloves even do? <laughs> Okay, um, attacks 5% faster for every spikes. After 5 hits, gain 1 in power. Doesn't actually buff anything else. Um, item activations cleanse and inflict poison. So we want him to activate a lot of things. Honestly, let's go Hexblades. I need backpack space, let's face it. I need backpack space. Okay, that's in a way backpack space. Technically for potions. Okay. Not ideal. I mean, we've got that being pointless, so let's put it where it's actually going to be put on something. Pocket lint, uh, not great. <laughs> okay, so you can smash open the piggy bank with the hammer, and that becomes something. <laughs> What could that possibly become? Hey, okay, Lucky Backpack is obviously just for the Ranger. They've got some interesting stuff. What could smashing open the piggy bank become out of these? Like, there's literally nothing on there that that would look like it becomes. Okay, we want more space. Activate twice as quick. Even more space. <laughs> okay, right. So now we're not suffering for space. In fact, I'm going to move that over by Gubert so that I can fit the banana in. Okay, we're no longer suffering for space. That is triggering off one. Goobert's getting a little less activations, but a little less activation, a little more memes. <laughs> um, that'll do. Okay, we've got three lives. You've got two brooms, a sword, and a dagger. I think you've got you've got a lot of bananas, but I think you're using up too much stamina. So, you know, your bananas are wow, almost kept you alive. I didn't think the bananas would do it. Um, press so hard your thumb hurts. Okay. Do, 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 do. Next hit is critical. We could get more Gooberts or... I could get a 
dragon. I mean... <laughs> Solve that problem. We have... What does this do? 20% um, chance to remove a random buff from your opponent. Let's put it on that one. Obviously, it would be better on something that triggers a lot faster, but, you know, it is what it is. I need more backpack space. <laughs> so wait. Has the shovel had its day? I mean, not really. It's still hanging in there usefully, to be fair. That we can make work goobers and keep this in play because we've only got one card and still use our loyalty card. Okay, so everything is actually getting pretty triggered, pretty good. That needs one more space down there, but honestly, this is working surprisingly well. Considering the mess that it is. Oh my god, what the heck is your backpack? It is quite large. You've got a shovel, another frying pan, daggers, many monies. You've got things that trigger things quicker. We might lose this one. Shame! No, we beat shame! We beat them. It triggers 10% faster. I do like that. We can get some extra gloves. We can get a fly garlic. Um, inflict poison. I mean, it buffs with that, so why not? Du -du -du -du. Okay. Extra backpack space. Here's where we then start running into the usual issue. That we need so much more backpack space than we actually have. Okay, so that's going to trigger at some point. You know, we're just going in with this for now. We've got some pocket lint that we might as well throw at them. <laughs> right, okay. Um, you've got two goobits. Oh, they're going for Omni Super Goobit Zords. Male Semnim. is going down surprisingly because they look like they should be stronger than me and yes we win <laughs> okay extra potion bag and then lovers i mean extra space is extra space and that's future planning for you know getting potions but for now You need to <laughs> first rearrange all of this. For now, it is just going to enable us. Okay. The number card before it is odd. Well, you know, that's going to be triggering nothing because there's no advantage to that, is there? Um, right. So, Pocket Lint is not better than that. This can go on to. Oh, it combines with that. Okay, so they're going to combine together to make a more powerful thing. <laughs> uh, we got eight monies. Um, do I want spikes? Doesn't go with anything, so I will say no. Charizard! Uh, for each card before, gain three something. And then that's on sale cheap, so I like extra daggers. Facts. We're going to sell this pocket lint, and we're not going to reserve it. We're just going to take it, and then we do another buff on that. So everything's getting buffed to heck by that, and then just more and more daggers to the face. It is never over. <laughs> Zaji has an interesting build. Are there any weapons, though? I think he's died in no time. Zaji is 
dead. That he is dead. <laughs> okay, I mean, hungry blades. It is time that we get rid of this shovel, isn't it? Right, the time has come. The hungry blades better than the shovel. So we should get rid of the shovel, and that frees us up a bit of space. We don't have... well, we do have space down there now. Um, that's going to get replaced with that, so that that triggers faster. We're going to shove that onto the Hungry Blade. And... <laughs> Suddenly, everything's going pretty good. Consume this and inflict some poison to the enemy and then one to ourselves. If we had a cleanse, that'd be pretty good. Okay. Reduce damage taken. Sure, let's reduce some damage for a round and then we'll figure things out from there. Right. We're in such a good situation that I don't need to bother with too much. Right, you've got a fancy blade there. Okay, spectral dagger. You've got a falcon blade, but master of nothing. <laughs> Goes down because he is master of nothing. <laughs> Okay, uh, potions. It might be time to start getting some potions, but then I need to... <laughs> then I need to disassemble our entire backpack to figure potions out. Okay, we've got space over there, but it does get rid of this if I do decide to do that. But I can actually do that. Okay, so if I go with that instead of that, and then I take these out for now, and I put these into potions, and I put that there. Okay, so if the number of cards before it is odd, and it is odd, right, and then Charizard can go down like that. Then we venture into potion territory. <laughs> And I still need to put my sword back in. Let's not forget that. Okay. That wasn't too bad. Now... We've still got a whole bunch of trash that we never really use. I just end up filling my bag with shit that, you know, ends up there. Okay, so that needs another stone to make a stone skin poke. Okay, that makes things trigger faster for each start item. They can trigger a lot of stuff. That's, you know, we've got a lot of daggers. They would be pretty good. Like, it does mess up Goobus. It does mess up Gubit, but... Okay. <laughs> we need to figure this out. There's the way to make this work. What does that do? Okay, so that poisons things that are in the backpack, right? So... I mean, I'm okay with that not min maxing everything okay so that triggers faster if i could get something good in there right the dagger extra dagger okay. i want the dragon i kind of want goobert in there as well somehow Is there a way that i can get goobert in there <laughs> not at the moment I mean, there is. I can shove Goobit in there for the moment. Like, I think that's worth it for the moment. And a bit of pocket lint, right? We will figure things out, but for the moment, that works. You know, there's things that we definitely need to rearrange and 
faff with, but it'll do. <laughs> it's a mess, but it'll do. Okay, big fiery potions. And a lot of blood sucking. And uh, villain swords. Melee weapons deal two less damage. Okay, but he's going down. <laughs> no, we didn't need to. He is a sad fella. Hashtag. And we're through to the next round. Um, potion bag is extra space. <laughs> okay, there's um, two there. Right. Extra space is extra space. We've got so much money. Jesus Christ. Okay, right. So time to take a few things out and <laughs> contemplate life. Right, that's gonna sit like that. Honestly, that can sit like that. Um, right, so Gubert needs triggers, which is maybe easier said than done. <laughs> okay, so that is wasting one thing. But. That's not really a trigger, is it? Um, start a battle, that's not really a trigger, but whatever, you know, and that only thrown once, so it's not that good. But <laughs> okay, that's gonna start there, that's gonna go to... Right, so next to this critical number of cards before results, right, let's put the lovers. Ace of Spades, Charizard. Ruby Chonko? How could you not have a Ruby Chonky boy? Okay, so he evolves with Charizard cards. Interesting. Um, let's give me that then. Give me that. Ruby Chonko. Let's throw some sand in their face. And <laughs> I mean, we're evolving a, evolving a Ruby Chonko. It's, it's not looking like a great backpack, but whatever. It'll get, it'll go through. It's a mess, but it'll do. Tatsarumu has a lot of blood sucking and is literally favored to blood sucking. But we are somehow holding in there and we're getting a Ruby Chonko. Nah. <laughs> we lost, but that's fine. Ruby Chonko! <laughs> Isn't he a cute little derpy boy? Um, Ruby Chonk. Gain uh, heat. All dragons. All items trigger 2% faster per stack. When you have at least 10 heats, he has a 30% chance to stun your opponent. Now, somehow, I need to make room for this chonky boy. Okay, Ruby Chonko is sitting in the corner. <laughs> is uh, doing some interesting stuff. But then we don't get that triggering and there's got to be a way that I can get to that, right? And the way is in the shop. Empower. I mean, sure, give me Empower. There we go. Right, and then I need to... Figure out <laughs> how to fit all of this in. Right, that will go there and then that will go there. Perfect. Okay. Ruby Chonko. And then that goes there. And then that goes there for now. Now I can make it go that way so it's actually future proof. But then again... I really need things that trigger Gooberts. That evolves that, but how the heck do I make that work? 
I'd have to do it. Okay, so we remove the banana for now to make that work. Things will get rearranged and replaced. I don't want to mess things up too much just for my own peace of mind. <laughs> Because otherwise it's going to be really, really, really frustrating to replace everything back in. We're going to use very high stamina. The banana would be very, very good. It would. There's just no way of getting it in there. Okay, Ruby Chonko, it's all on you. I choose you. <laughs> you derpy little boy. We've got to survive five rounds. Very poison heavy builds. Yes, Jesus then. But somehow is Ruby Chonko carrying Somehow we won that. How I don't know. But somehow we won that. Okay, that's got a slot. So now that we've fixed that, fixed that, okay, so that's triggering those, that, banana can go there, I guess. Okay, so that'll trigger the banana faster, that triggers the weapons faster. Again, yeah, you know, it's not perfectly min-max, but it'll do, it'll do. <laughs> um, right, so White Eyes Blue Dragon um, gained a lot of stuff. Right, so that lets us get that in there. We've got boots to go by Ruby Chonko. Again, I just am keeping all of the trash in the inventory. I'm not getting rid of the trash. We keep the trash at all times. Okay. So we make three healing potions, or, you know, stone skin potions, whatever. It'll do. Um, stone. I'm going to put the stones... That's unfortunate. Because they have to be both to the side of it. Okay. It's always just a little too challenging, isn't it? It's just always a little too awkward. I think I might have to, like, sack a round of thing, you know, that'll do. We're just gonna sack a round of that getting buffed to get the stone skin potion, and then... Then we have lost our protection off of that as well. Three. Or do I? <laughs> okay. <laughs> what did I just do? I've messed this entire infantry up tremendously.
I just messed this entire frame. We'll have to figure it all out again, but it'll be fine, right? So that can go there and remain the sentient potion. That's fine, right? This'll do. We gotta survive four rounds with three lives. I'm sure we'll be fine. Okay, you've got a lot of cards which you're playing. You're playing the lovers, you're playing the ace of spades. Lovers, the ace of spades, the lovers, the ace of spades, the, the death by cards. <laughs> They just had more powerful cards than us. Okay, so that needs to go back there. That's going to go there. Does the 10% faster mean anything to that? I don't think it does, does it? Like, it seems to get a buff, but... Okay. Vampiric Blades rather than the stone, I think is good. I, I could get that in there. <laughs> if I could only get that in there without it messing everything up, right. Whatever. <laughs> At this point, I'm just like, yeah, whatever. <sighs> okay, um, give me the extra card slot, maybe, or that, I don't know. Yeah, we'll just shove it up there for now, and we'll figure it out in the next round. Because <laughs> we're not dead yet. They've also got a Ruby Chonko! Okay, this is the battle of the cards and the Ruby Chonkos, and I think they might have better stuff than us. Staff of Unhealing! Game is Glagger. How did I beat you? <laughs> How did I beat you? Okay, so now we've made a... Bloody Dagger. I think a bloody dagger is better than that dagger, so I'm going to take that. Okay. Right, so. <laughs> Again, trying to figure out things. Aha. Uh Aha. -huh. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Okay, so that gets the maximized triggers, although I kind of want you to be off of that one. Okay, so that gets the weapon involved with that again. And then I need something in there, which is that, which buffs both swords as well. Now, if I could get the poison in there as well, then, you know, that would do some business. But, okay. <laughs> I, I keep hold of all of the trash that we end up with. Um, yeah, I can definitely figure this out to make this work, right? <laughs> There's three holes. I'm sure there's a way. Right. Before we buy it. <laughs> okay. That makes two together. Right, leave that there for now. There has to be a way that I can make the three work, right? Okay, so I put four up there with one of those. I can take that to go there. I can buy the three. And I can put that there. Okay. <laughs> we did it! We filled the backpack! Okay, then we need to get you back involved there. Okay. Now. Ace of spades is second. Lovers. Ace of spades. To that. To that. To that. Okay. Right. We saved it. Um, the trumpet. Removes one stamina for opponent. Increases cooldown. Right. And um, after five, they stun for one second. I mean, I'm a simple person. Dagger is extra damage. 
So we take dagger. Okay, Flay Garrick goes there. Honestly, at this point, money irrelevant, right? <laughs> money leads to our concerns. And it's on sale, keep. He doesn't need to be upright. Okay, so. If I swap that. With that. Okay, that gets all those triggers. That triggers everything. We got some pocket link to go in a corner. Um, survive two rounds with two lives. Stamina usage medium. Honestly, like the the stamina hasn't been that bad. Yeah, we'll just keep hold of the four, and we'll be optimistic that we get out of this. <laughs> then this guy's also got a min max backpack. Okay, he's got a bow. He's got some fancy mana thirst swords. He's got a lot of bananas. He is getting pulled apart though. He's got birds. Nature boy is getting cooked by big Charizard. <laughs> okay, 13. We've got to survive one more round. There's an extra goo, but that's not going to do it. Um, items trigger 5% faster and remove a look from your opponent. Where would we even put the birds? Like, <laughs> I just don't have the space to, to mess about and shove that in there, you know? It's nice and all, but there's, there's just nowhere that I can shove that. Um, an extra Charizard, there's this one. Opponent drops possessed below 50%, we consume it and deal more damage to our opponent. Again, you know, there's just... Not really a good way of fitting that in. Um, we need to survive one more round. Like, that's not going to do anything for us. That one might. That's not going to do anything for us anymore. So... Honestly, the stamina... We're okay with stamina. Um, what else is doing nothing for us? They gain damage. Sure, that might do something for us. Um, yeah, none of this is doing anything for us, so... Nothing really doing anything for us. Um, that can go into something, so we'll buy it just because it goes into something. That doesn't plug into anything, although... Gain one mana and gain luck. Um, item activate 66% chance to gain a mana. I mean, just to give Goober an activation. I'm going to take it. You know, it counts towards his activations. The an extra dagger. There's no way. It, it does not fit. There's... There's no way that it fits, right? <laughs> there is. But it's too much effort. Like, it's not worth it. we got to survive with one already, again. Uh, that's just a stone. We've got a corner that we can fit a stone in. Why not? A free corner. <laughs> Poison potion. I mean, you know, there's nothing else. Okay, this is our winning thing with the um, the Ruby Chonko. <laughs> Ruby Chonko saves the day. Okay, you got to give it. You're a fatigue run. You got all the infinite potions in the world. Jesus Christ, you have all of the magic in the world. It's the Jack, but the Jack is going down with his super potions. He never got us below fifty percent, so half his potions didn't trigger. 14 wins! Undefeated! Undefeated. Undefeatable. <laughs> Into gold rank already! Let's go.
98 wins. Don't know what the Linux symbol is there for. But yeah, there's some um, things like you can be Kiwi or you can be not Kiwi. I don't know how the heck you get other things. <laughs> so, you know, and it's interesting that there's seemingly only one Kiwi, but I've seen like three or four other types of Kiwi that were in there. So I don't know how the heck you do any of that or get any of the other stuff, but... <laughs> Undefeated. Do you think we should go for one more run? You know, like <laughs> we should. There's, you know, we gotta give people a chance to beat us. Okay, well, I didn't mean to take the backpack. I was trying to take that. Less weapons. Right, we'll take one of these. We'll take the thing that's on sale. Regeneration. I mean, extra money. Sure. Give me regen. Okay, we're doing some damage. It's not going to be that good. But, you know, future proofing. Okay, you've got a dagger ready as the swords. You are winning this one, I think. I don't think our regen is going to be... Is it? Maybe our regen keeps us alive. Okay, regen really pretty good. Surprisingly. I don't like that dagger that you had. Um... So that helps buff that, which we want to make a hero sword, probably. And that goes into that, so let's buy that. And then, inventory space. <laughs> okay. I don't think this is the greatest start, but I'll take it. Frying pan and some bananas. And a bit of luck. A gentleman is the Ent. He's not a gent, he's just an Ent, a tree man. Well, is it going to be tremendous? I don't know. I think fatigue is going really, really slow because he's regenning. But I think he loses this one <laughs> at the end of the day. Okay, that's two wins already under the belt. And there's our hero swords. Okay, that's a good start. I mean, a little bit of cheap extra regen. On attack, chance to prevent four damage and remove stamina from your opponents. And it goes spiky. Do I want to be spiky builds? We haven't done spiky builds. Maybe. Let's reserve it. Sure. Let's make it a spiky thing. And, you know. Okay. He's got a shovel and a sword. And he's trying to go for the hero sword as well flow with his potion. The potion might be enough to keep him alive. It's not. He's actually going down considering <laughs> it, it, his stamina usage. He just ran, ran out of stamina. On science, he should win this, but one banana was not enough to give him the stamina he needed. Okay, let's take that and then I will take another expansion. And then we've already got one of these. But let's also put in that. Just because it can. <laughs> but just because it can doesn't mean you should. Okay, he's got bananas and a goobert and a lucky piggy. Which gains the money when the shop and He also gains luck. So, you know, that's pretty good for him. But he's only got one sword. This will go slow. And he's also not using the goobert at all. It's not activating on anything. He fucked up. <laughs> he wasted that goobert. It's, you know, goobert could have made all the difference, but you didn't even trigger it. You could have rearranged your backpack to make goobert work, but you did not. Well, that's one, so why would you not buy it? Because it just is used. <laughs> It's not the best use, but it is used. Uh, banana heals and regenerates stamina. Okay, what does this even trigger with? Nothing, nothing. Okay, so what are you meant to be triggering? Okay, it triggers with extra weapons. So if we get more weapons, that might be pretty good. Can I make a lucky piggy? No. What are you trying to work with? The potion, of course. I'm just 
going to go with that. <laughs> We've got plenty of energy, so... Okay, they are getting ahead of us, but they are wasting all their stamina, so they lose this one. Surely. No! <laughs> okay, even though they wasted all their stamina, I've built poorly. Okay, potion bag. Future proof the shop. Make it better. I need better gear. <laughs> okay, that is a good sword. So we will take that and that will get buffed by this. Gloves? Gloves make things trigger faster. They're not the worst thing to have. Okay. They're on sale for two. I should take it. You know, triggering 20% faster is pretty good. Okay, bananas, lots of swords, you got a frying pan. You know, Sid fan might get us here. But they don't. <laughs> they have better stuff, but they just didn't take it. Okay, so, I mean, we haven't done a vampires yet. Weapons steal 20% life, your healing is amplified. Okay. I mean, that's two weapons that are life-stealing. Another potion bag. Okay, we need to rearrange things a bit. Opponent drops below a percent and then they do things right. So that can sit there for now. Um, things trigger faster. <laughs> Items trigger faster. Banana triggering faster wouldn't be the worst, honestly. Falcon Blade? What does that need? Two pairs of gloves? Okay, maybe we make a Falcon Blade. But for the moment, <laughs> this is our backpack. Okay, so I think we're gonna try and find that Falcon Blade. You have a goober who's trying to be poison goober. You've got a shovel. You are a fatigue calm again. You're out of stamina because, my god, you messed up with all these heavy attacks. And you're going to die now. <laughs> you know, whilst you are prepared for the fatigue, I am sucking all of your blood back. Oh, wait, you got a lot of health back because you had a health potion. <laughs> Okay, you almost got it back with that health potion there uh, in the end. You were prepared for the fatigue. The Amphitigo. Okay, stamina back. I can afford that and the date thing right. So we need to figure out a way to get that in <laughs> and combine that with that. Okay, um, right, so, I mean... I put that there, and I buy that, and then I figure out the exact place where that needs to go. I realise that the falcon blaze has gone out the window for the moment. Right, that's going to sit like that then. And then that's going to go there for now. Obviously, once it does its thing, we will have better situations. And then, like, a stone is one. And I might as well take it, and then we can set it back for one. Or just hold on to it forever, because I'm stupid and hold on to it forever. Uh, you're trying to be a spiky boy, but you've also got a spiky remover. And that is a problem, because we have a spiky shield. But I think somehow we might still win this with the blood sucking. It... <laughs> It did look good, but somehow we won that. Okay, that's on sale for one, so, you know, it's literally basically free. Okay, let's put that back there. That goes there. Then... I don't want to bust a sword. I mean, extra space is always good. You can't say that that is not the case.
I want this falcon blade, so we need to figure out how to get that. <laughs> I mean, do we take two hungry blades? It doesn't seem smart. It seems pretty stupid. But <laughs> okay, I'm gonna take that for now, right? We're gonna look for some extra gloves to try and make this falcon blade. You have the falcon blade. Okay, it's um, item trigger thirty percent faster and it attacks twice. Okay, that's pretty good. So when we get that, we're out of stamina. Okay, Machida has used their health potion already. It was close. Well, we lost it. That was a close one. Okay, that's an extra attack. That's just more backpack space. Like, why did it look like that was part of it? It doesn't seem to be, but it did look like it was part of it. Okay, now... We don't normally take clothes or armor, <laughs> and we usually win, so I don't know if I've got a really good build here. I think I've gone really, really shit. Okay, um, honestly, we're maybe beating Talos still with his steel goobers and much better weapons and multiple shields. Somehow we still win that. <laughs> Okay, a flute um, triggers 10% faster for each item and randomly gains stuff. I <laughs> More backpack space. Randomly gains 12 that or 2 stamina or 2 look. I don't think it's good. Cards! Cards are good, but then again... So is that. <laughs> um, hmm. Right, one. How much do you sell for? Two. I can sell... One lot of regen and that. To take that. I think that's worth it. Okay, well, now we've come across the Yu Gi Oh! champion and we're just gonna lose. <laughs> because they've got all the cards in the world, but somehow, whoop, oh, they're instantly that. Lover's card right there just screwed us. I think some of their other ones might not be in a correct order and they weren't doing a lot. But that one! <laughs> when it hits, it hits. Um, on attack deals one more damage. I mean, sure. Okay. If the number of cards before it is odds, like... We've got to start somewhere. The cards have to start somewhere. Like, there's no cards before it, so, you know, that's fine. Okay. No point re-rolling. Um, you've got a lot of weapons. And a poison goobert, and you're making a stronger potion. And... Your weapons are buffed by all of these... Sword, Sims kill top. You're out of stamina though. But I think you're still winning. <laughs> yeah, no, they've won. Because they've got blood swords. Okay, so they had a good way of triggering a lot of lifesteal. Yeah, we were due for a loss. <laughs> um, generates three mana for every card before and for every. It's not really that good, is it? Potion belts. Put 
the potion in the potion belt. Lovers! Okay. So, if the number of cards for a season gain to regen, it's not that good at the, at the beginning, but it'll add up. Um, items trigger faster, remove one luck from your opponents. Okay. I mean, you count as a thing that can be triggered faster. Okay. That is not that good. <laughs> Let's put that there. That there. Okay. Now, I realize that he's not getting that used. That's unfortunate. Okay, if I swap that with that one, that's a much better use of that. Then the lover's card can go there, and that can go all the way up there. Okay, so we've rearranged that a bit better. Obviously, we've taken the spiky shield out of the equation. <laughs> I can sell the regen to get that. And then I can rotate that and fit that in. Okay. This is so not min-maxed at all. Okay, that's not even useful to that. That triggers that. Okay, then that can go there, and then the banana can go like that. But again, still not really doing the effectiveness of all of the stuff. Like, the falcon blades is out the window if I do that. That triggers 20% faster, but that's fine. That doesn't have a trigger. That does, but again, you know, I kind of want... ...birds... ...involved. Okay. That's doing things a little better. There's just no way of rearranging this ideally in this instance, is there? We've got one life left and I think we've already lost this, so I might as well take a moment to actually figure this out. Right, that can go miles out of the way, right, so. Bye, Garrick. That... Keep that on that. I hate that it sort of takes it off when you don't want to, right? So if I move that there, that's in that. The dragon is in a good position to only trigger the one thing. That's a little wasteful, but that's fine. Again, still a little wasteful. I can't have the dragon there because it takes the lover's card out. <laughs> and we need the lover's card involved. <laughs> okay, so if I can fit something in there. It's just not any good way of doing this. Right, that'll do. I think we've lost this one, sadly. 
Look at this backpack. Now we're in goals. You know. Fairbin Faber TTV. How is destroyed with this? What is going on with his builds and he is losing? How is he losing this? Okay, no, he's hanging in there. He's got like infinite health. Oof. Oof. That guy held in there so hard and lost it. If I were them, I would be sad too. Okay, that is going on here. <laughs> um, right, so we need to find a way to keep Charizard in there somehow. Whilst also getting the card involved. Okay, so I think what I'm going to do is the cards are going to move. Right, Ace of Spades is going to come over here. That heart is coming down here. That is going over there. <laughs> okay. Now that... It's not do a lot for us, did it? <laughs> okay, that lets the Charizard get in there and get buffed. Okay, perfect. The Charizard is involved. That can go there. I know it's not ideal, but whatever. <laughs> okay, we're in there. We're still in it. And then I'll take an extra bag of holding just because we can. You know, a little extra shield might just keep us alive for one more run. <laughs> Carrots, bananas, a frying pan, a big fancy corrupted swords, fancy fencing rapier. So many magic genie potions. But are they helping you? You've got a stone skin potion. Okay, that suddenly hurt. Where did that come from? <laughs> Fatigue just instantly hurt us and did nothing to him. We were at nine. But that is still ranking up. <laughs> that wasn't to lose. That was still ranking up somehow. Okay, right. Well, that's where I'm going to call it a day on Backpack Battles. Have a lovely rest of your evening. And thank you to Video Lucas, who was here earlier. And I hope you all have a lovely rest of your weekend, and I'll catch you all again soon. Bye bye bye.